I hate cringy voiceovers. But my alarm started going off during recording and it scared the crap out of me. So I screamed super high pitched. That'd be extra more annoying. But the easiest way to legit keep steady with your drill bit is to keep it on a lower setting. For real. One won't do anything. Two don't do much. Don't go higher than five. Believe me, I have the scars to prove it. <laughs> then you just take your time. Like, legit, take your time. Going slow strokes, st like, and then just tickle the drill bit slowly through. I suck at recording. I'm learning. I'm not a YouTube fanatic, but I'm trying to help everybody be as crafty as I am. I love crafts. I love making things. I always have 5 million different projects going on all at once. My boyfriend literally hates me because I have all my crafting stuff sprawled around the room like a psycho. But just slow movements with the drill bit. Barely touch it. Don't If you have to apply pressure with your electric file, you are doing something wrong. Your bit is broken. It is fudged. You need a new one, girl. Or dude. Whatever. You're just barely going to touch the surface and it's going to take it off. I promise you, if you got a good drill bit, you're going to want to do it. Now, I encapsulated some heart beads in this, so my overlay was not the greatest. Okay, I had, I needed to sand that buddy down and shape it. <laughs> but I got there with slow movements. Slow movements. Okay, when you're doing press-ons, it's way different than uh, when you're doing somebody else's nail. Like, you can sit in one spot if you absolutely need to. You know, practice makes perfect. Like, I just started doing press-ons not even that long ago. And believe me, I have an entire box full of nails I need to fix. <laughs> because I got excited and I wanted to try new things and they didn't turn out the greatest because you know i'm a perfectionist but just keep going keep trying you will get there you'll learn don't let everybody else's things on youtube or anywhere that look perfect or seem easy discourage you because you're gonna make mistakes you know how many sets i've made so far where i'm literally on like the last two nails and i screw them up so bad or I did them so great and then I'm going to file them down and make them perfect and I take a whole chunk of the side off. <laughs> like, just keep going, you know? Like, it's not that hard. I make my own nails for right now. I'm hoping that once I get better, I can start selling them and make, you know, just a little more on a little side hustles. But yeah, like I said, just take your time and then when you're done, you're just going to get that residue off of it put a good light layer of top coat on there put it in there and you know uv cure it and bam bam thank you ma'am there you go it's done we did it yay me all right well i don't know what else to say and this is the most awkward talking nail video of all time so um enjoy the silence for the rest of it bye